This is Liam Manning and this is my walkthrough of my digital media web production project. Here is my homepage, what has the mission statement, what was given to me by my uh, lecturer. Here we have my logo page with the five designs I have in one image and if we scroll down we see more. This is the one I'm going with, it's my fourth design because I thought it really stood out more. I did these in Photoshop, just laying layers together. Here we have my animation page with some of my animations on it. As you can see it's just a very simple four second design with where I used the timeline tool in Photoshop to bring to change the opacity and position. And I also did the south end animations, what was needed during this course. Moving on to some videos. Here I have three videos. One of them I did for a tutorial. The first one here is one I did in my for my first ever media project. It's just a very quick footprint 99 design. Here I have a later project. It's just a little horror title sequence what I filmed, directed all myself. And we there might be a problem with it this one because it's meant to be a tutorial what was set but uh, for some reason only one video is on it so i might have to have a closer look at that we want the audio here's some audio design work what i've done i use some for my own projects and some tutorials here's just a couple of images i took and edited a while back during a previous course and here is some graphic design I decided to add in just for to fill up more space all I did for these ones was get images of people and layer textures and things on it and design the background using LGBTQ plus flags Moving on to the client page, as you can tell, it's just six companies, what came to mind, what my productions would work for. Here's just what we offer on the service page. And finally, we have the contact us page, where it has where you can put your name, your email, write a message to the company, and it might be able to work. As you can tell, I'm just going to do a little example, see if it loads properly. As you can tell, it's it's just very standard first name, last name, email address, and the message. And we also have the map on this page. If I click on directions, it will take you to the link of where to go to find it. I'm currently at the university where I've set the location. So obviously, it will just be glitched. And yeah, I also added some. You can find us on pages here.